Hello, my lovely YouTubers. Welcome to the channel of the Lacoacious One. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone is fine because I'm fine. Alrighty, folks. Thank you for tuning in if you're a first time viewer. And thank you for tuning in if you're Ride or Dyer or a new subscriber. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for all of your very, very, very nice comments. I appreciate those so much it makes my day and i try to respond to them uh as quickly as possible i may a few may slip through but i will eventually get to you uh time is um a little tight but still that's no excuse but i do do appreciate you and also i would like to add that i am trying to come up <sighs> With the ominous task of finding something that's appropriate um, to do as a uh, giveaway. And I would like to say appreciation, really not just giveaway, but just appreciation. I have to calculate what I want to give, what's appropriate, and exactly how I want to do it. So that announcement will be coming up soon. Because my anniversary is in August. So, yeah, I have to hop on that uh, ASAP. So, um, okay, I'm going to get to the task at hand. And it is on home decor items that you can get affordably. Things that are kind of trending, if you must say. But you don't want to spend those Z Gallery prices. Nothing against Z Gallery. Love the stuff. It's gorgeous. Those can be quite pricey sometimes. All right. Today's haul will be from Family Dollar, Dollar Tree. That's it. So let's get it crack a -lack it. I'm going to start from the back as usual and come forward. I'm going to show you the first item, which if you've been following me, you know I, I just Google oh Gaga over these type of products. It is the Mermaid Sequence. And I've been hauling sequin pillows all year. And look what I found right here. Little accent pillow rectangular. And it was at, of all places, Family Dollar. Now, this pillow was, you know, I'm cheap. A frugal. $10. But folks, I had to have it. And I got it. And if you know how mermaid sequins run, when you brush them in a direction, they give off a different pattern. So, that's what that looked like. If that isn't too up close. So, I found this for $10. Grabbed it. And they only had two. And uh, the clerk said that's how it was shipped to the store with only two pillows. So I feel that this was a super deal. It's the little perfect accent for what I already have. It's going to make it really pop. I love this. Awesome. Pillows are just the perfect accent. Pictures, pillows, picture frames, I should say. Picture frames, pillows candles are the least expensive way to change out your decor and add that oomph to it if you know what i mean candles also add ambiance and warmth and glow uh we have accent pillows depending on the design it just sets the tone the mood and expresses who you really are i feel your personality comes through to me by the pillows you use Picture frames are those often neglected items where people just find a frame because it fits and pop a picture into it. No, the picture frame should tell the story of the room as well as accent the picture. And then on top of that, when you go into other areas of the house, napkins. When we set tables, we tend to just think of the plates, the cups, the glasses. But the napkin says a lot, too. And it says it uh, affordable. And then when you pop on a napkin ring, bam, the table's made. Okay, so I'm just going all off subject. But 
you know, yeah, pillows, they do it for me. Now, if you've been following me, you know that I've been color scheming my outdoor entertainment wear for the summer. And I'm changing my color scheme for kitchen this summer. And I went with green, real pretty lime green. So I found these green accessories that I can use in my kitchen for summer. And they're affordable. This little pineapple, and I love pineapple. Pineapples are the, um, what do you call it? I want to say, they are the icon or the symbol of hospitality, is what I'm trying to say. These were $2. $2. Aren't they cute? Family dollar. Family Dollar got it going on. I'm telling you, I can't begin to tell you the great stuff that I got from Family Dollar, decor-wise. You just have to be there at the right time. I also found this um, soap dispenser. It could be a lotion dispenser. $2. Cute. Also, from Family Dollars, I found this little pineapple, a great accent piece. Two dollars. Yeah. You don't have to break the bank to make a statement. And uh, that was all I picked up as far as uh, decor items. They had some other things that I'm going back to get. I'm telling you, check out Family Dollar for summer entertainment. Pshh. As well as Family Dollar also for the plates and all that. But for a little home decor pieces, Family Dollar hit quite a bit up in there. Okay, next thing I did was hop over to uh, Dollar Tree. And I found this little Buddha, which I liked. And that's going on my home altar. Because um, that can be expensive. Oh, my light is changing. That could be expensive. But this, I thought, was for a dollar. That's a few nicks, but I'm going to touch that up. But it's not a bad deal for a dollar. And let me reach back here and get these. I found these where they keep the candle and picture frames at. And they are LED lights, 240 total hours, which make it 120 each. They are black and white damask type pattern. And I am going to do a um vignette with it so i purchased those they also have these little um led votive candles in a silver mercury and a gold mercury uh pattern uh it didn't i don't know i didn't see a light so it may look different but it, it didn't say much to me so i didn't get it till i see someone else use it or put it in another vignette. I passed on that. And just stuck to tried and true. The black and white damask. Okay. Coming up. Dollar Tree had these wonderful wood plaque signs. With sayings on it. This one says family. Is made of love and laughter. I thought that was cute. And they had this next one. Believe in yourself. And you will be unstoppable. Great to put on a small space shelf. Or um mantra your dresser wherever you need inspiration from i think those were great for a dollar you cannot beat it i know you can't come on folks one dollar look at the script on this look folks come on you better stop sleeping and stop playing with yourself get over the dollar tree all righty a little bit more forward these were so cute and i'm going back because it's hard to find out but they had it in gray. I should have got the gray. But I really didn't have a need for it at the time, which is why I didn't get it. But I'm satisfied with the three trio. I got tea, tea light holders. Some people said they're going to put um, cat tie in it. Well, you know, I don't know about that. But look, even without a tea light or candle, isn't it awesome? A tea light candle or whatever, that is still very sculptural. I like it. One buck a piece, folks. Another thing that Dollar Tree had are these, um, 
I think these are, what are these? They are heavy. I don't know if they're wood. I believe these are just wood. But it kind of feels like. Nope, it's breakable. So it's ceramic. These are ceramic um, plaques, if you want to call them. I don't know what how you would term these. But this one is in love. This one says love. This one says dream. I got them in the gold metallic. They also have them in silver. And they have them in black. And I think they have one or two more sayings. But love and dream were the ones that I picked out that I like. They may have had like hello, and I don't remember what the last one was, or if it was one, but I know they have these two. They had them in metallic gold, metallic silver, and black. These are cute to put on your desk, use them as paperweights, put them on a bookshelf, put them on your dressing table, wherever you have the need for a little extra inspiration and decor items, this would be that. Last but not least, we're winding on down. Okay, excuse me for just being everywhere. I am so tired today. It is my off day. I don't even know why I'm tired, folks. But I'm going to get you through this haul. I hope it's not unfair to you, but I just want to see what was trending because this is the only time I have. I'm going to be busy this week, so I want to make sure you get out there and get these great deals because this stuff does not last. It goes fast. Do not sleep. Folks, always keep at least an extra 20 on you. So when you go to the Dollar Tree, you have money to get something. You know what? Dollar Tree satisfied that instant, what do you call it? Instant gratification need I have. If I get a depressed, I'm not happy, or just bored, I generally go buy something at Dollar Tree. I challenge myself. I take $5, I take $10 to see what I can get. And that just uplifts me. The bargain hunting, the scouring, the uh, trying to find something uh, and make something out of something else. I always challenge myself to do that. Sometimes I come out with nothing, but most times I always do. So let me get on with this. I'm so sorry for being way off track. Look at these. These little pretty trinket trays. Oh, it is a silver metallic. It is a mermaid. I thought that was adorable. Just so cute. And they also had it. Look at this. Rose gold. If you find enough of them, purchase them for stocking stuffers or what have you. Ring trinkets. Great for your dressing tables and your bathrooms and your vanities. Those are so adorable. They're small, but they are perfect. You know, just the accent piece, just to put that beautiful ring on there would be just awesome. Alrighty. I also found these little white trinket dishes, which are so ethereal. And coordinated with this. Look at that. Or on your altar. Look at that. Multitude of you. This is a uh, praying. I don't know. if I believe this is Jesus. I don't know why people keep calling it Buddha. But this, I believe, is Jesus. So, I will be using this on my altar. Most likely with this. And other pieces I found at Dollar Tree. And I also found this elephant, which elephant um, with the, always buy them with the trunk up. The trunk must be up, never down. And you face them to the east. And that is a symbol of uh, prosperity. It brings money. It brings you money. Um the alternate with the trunk down will take away money or point it in another direction. But we always point these east with the trunk up. Okay. Well, that's at least my belief system. So, yeah, that was all I found in my little home decor challenge haul from Family Dollar and Dollar Tree. I think these look much more expensive. Look, look like something you would get at Crate and Barrel, Pottery Barn, that type of thing. I think these little ceramic, um, I don't know what you call these, ceramic plaques, I'm going to call them, in love and dream. They have them in gold, silver, and black. Check those out. Black would look awesome with this, perhaps. Something you could do with that. 
I might go back and get one more scene and put it that with that and do a vignette on that. Check out these wood plaques with mantras. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. This, if you had a family, a, a set of family uh, pictures with the beautiful frames, I hauled some copper frames that were awesome. This would just knock that out the ballpark. As well as you can use these beautiful, again, black damask lights with this. You have to just think outside the box. You don't need to spend a lot of money. You could, but why? Um, if you got altars, check out Dollar Tree for the incense, the candles, and their little Buddhas and little they they have all type of religious um, uh, symbols at Dollar Tree that you can purchase. Um, going on to Family Dollar, you see the pit, sequin pillows. They had tons of pillows and stuff for summer that was awesome. They also have these wonderful, in several colors, um, pineapples. And I know they had them in yellow. They had them in green. They had them, I believe, in the blue. This is a pump dispenser, and this is the salt and pepper shakers. That shakes it up a bit because, like I said, pineapples mean... Um, hospitality as well as this little trinket one now they did have a larger one but i was not going to pay the money for that i didn't want to but this for two dollars was right on budget and queue and served the purpose now family dollars also had um mason jars that had mercury glass finish and they light light up they were five dollars beautiful quality i thinking about seriously going back and getting them i didn't get them but now that i think about it i perhaps will because they put an awesome glow on your table i'm thinking about something i'm gonna do for outside wear so i will be checking them out for that uh, dollar tree also has wonderful flowers don't forget to get your flowers your florals um I did some arrangements. I don't have any to show you right now, but check them out. The spring ones are out. They are coming out now with the summer ones, and they look just awesome. The colors are just all inspiring. So that is all I have today. Check out Dollar Tree. Check out Family Dollar and get your decor. You don't have to spend all the money you would spend at Pier 1 or World Market or... Even Crate and Barrel, Pottery Barns, and Z Gallery. I love those places. I use them for inspiration, but they are high sometimes. And you can improvise, dupe. I'm going to give you a secret. Even check out thrift stores, Salvation Army, uh, Goodwill. Uh, but be very careful because sometimes, because they're on, you know, I hate to say it, it's a good purpose, but they're about making money. Sometimes the items tend to be higher than you can find it. I think they have vases I could find at Dollar Tree for more than a dollar. So I'm not going to do that one. But uh, you will find some unique items also. Replacement items. Items that you can spruce up by just washing with soap and water and painting them. Or embellishing them. So don't sleep on thrift stores. Um... Don't sleep on garage sales, okay? Making it your own sometimes is better and more creative. And it puts that personality into your home interior. All right, folks. I am out of here. Till next time, this is a questions one. Don't forget, don't forget to leave your questions, comments, cares, and concerns in the box below. If you enjoyed this video, please thumbs up and share with somebody. And if you're on social media, please share, share, share. I love you. Keep the comments coming. Thank you, Ryder Dyers. Thank you, new subscribers. And thank you for the subscribers that are about to click this button. Bye.